a best U.S. authority has cautioned of an up-and-coming war with Russia and has approached a huge number of troops to be prepared for redeployment towards the Russian outskirt. General Robert Neller, the authority of the U.S. Marine Corps positioned in Norway, declared the up-and-coming war on Thursday, indicating a move of concentrate on clashes in the Middle East to Russia and the Pacific District. I trust I'm wrong, however there's a war coming. Neller told the U.S. powers amid a visit to the Nordic nation. You're in a battle here, an instructive battle, a political battle, by your essence. Prestv.com reports, the best leader alluded to Russia and the Pacific as the following real regions of contention, foreseeing a major battle later on. I think presumably the concentration, the expected concentrate isn't on the Middle East, Neller stated when gotten some information about where the power saw itself battling later on. The emphasis is more on the Pacific and Russia. While the Marine Corps leader conceded that the U.S. troops would stay in the Middle East for quite a while to come, he indicated a slight pullback from that district and a reorientation toward Russia and the Pacific. Simply recall why you're here, he included. They're viewing. Much the same as you watch them, they watch you. We have 300 Marines up here, we could go from 300 to 3,000 overnight. We could increase present expectations. The remarks were made in the midst of pressures amongst Russia and NATO partners, with Moscow cautioning Oslo that the nearness of American troops could hurt relations after the Nordic nation chose to have another unit of U.S. fighters through the finish of 2018. The sending will strain officially tense relations with Russia as it conflicts with a promise made by Norway not to permit the organization of remote battle powers on its dirt unless the nation was under the danger of assault or for military drills. Russia and NATO have had stressed ties since strife emitted in eastern Ukraine approximately three years prior. More than 10,000 have been murdered in the war in Ukraine's mechanical east, where the Kiev government is battling professional Russia powers. Russia has for some time been careful about NATO's extension eastbound, toward Russia's western fringes. NATO has conveyed around 4,000 troops, comprising of four fight gatherings, to Estonia, Lithuania, Latvia, and Poland as of late. The U.S. is likewise occupied with joint military boards mostly with South Korea and Japan in the Pacific area as a show of power against North Korea in light of Pyongyang's atomic and ballistic rockets program. North Korea, officially worried by the U.S.'s changeless and substantial military nearness in the area, has depicted the drills as an incitement.